going on guys for everyone ghost here coming back at you with another awesome one piece discussion video uh this is probably the biggest topic that's ever happened discussing uh luffy's dream uh, a lot of people are giving it a lot of attention and they're discussing what it was that luffy's dream was and comparing it to roger and rogers and luffy's dreams being almost similar to some extent and you know kind of exactly going into the past that they chose as pirate kings or wanting to become pirate kings um, honestly, I don't want to make this uh, a long tangent conversation, so I want to try to shorten it as much as possible. Um, honestly, you know, hearing about this dream and seeing the reactions of his crewmates and everyone around him in the in the ship, including his ship in Yamato, uh, kind of being very, very shocked to find out what it was his dream was or to kind of hear about what it is that his dream is, you know, and. A lot of them kind of shook it off and saying, you're crazy that, you know, you're trying to stretch this a little too far. You know, you always come up with some crazy things. Now, if you haven't read the manga or, or read any of what's going on, uh, this is a lot of spoilers coming at you. Um, but as a, as a fan of One Piece, as a fan of Luffy, uh, seeing where his journey lies and him wanting to, you know, be that person to find that One Piece and find everything or find and do everything that he can before you know, whatever it is that his journey is at his ends, you know, because obviously after Wano, which is probably the biggest arc to have happened in One Piece, other than obviously Marine Ford and Amazon Lily and so many other places that I, I, I can't even fathom to remember right now. It's too much. Um, but here's, here's what I'll say. Luffy has done some things that I've never thought I'd ever see him do. He's always found that will to keep fighting when everyone needs him to. And one of the things I love about Luffy is that he'll never give up if those who need him the most give him his hope, his strength, and his joy to continue to fight. And obviously, he always fights for the right reasons. He never does things for himself. He always does things for others. And he's always been a very joyous person. And... I think one of the things that I think Luffy wants in all reality is to bring joy to the world, bring happiness to the world, you know, because Luffy as the Pirate King can do that. I think he wants to stop the the violence, the the wars, the the, catas the catastrophes. I think he really just wants peace. You know, he's not saying to stop being a pirate, but I think there is a limit to being a pirate and realizing that you're harming others right now. I'm not saying Luffy's a saint. I'm not saying Luffy hasn't done, you know, some pirating himself and he's gone around and pillaged, but obviously you've seen his journey for however long you have. And we can most assure that he's done nothing of ill that any one of us can recall. So that's one of the reasons why I bring up his dream being to bring joy to the world and wanting peace. I think, uh, Roger, when he went out, he was hoping the new generation can take over his will, I think, in some extent. And I'm not saying that they did, but in some extents, a lot of people are saying that Luffy kind of did. And obviously, Luffy, you know, has some similarities to Roger, as well as Ace did being his son. But obviously, we can only know so much finding out in the details. But uh, it, this is an incredible you know, conversation that I would love to have further in the future. Uh, definitely, that's my thoughts on Luffy's dream. I think that that's really what he wants. Uh, obviously, if you know Luffy, you know the kind of person Luffy is and what he fights for and what he wants. I mean, honestly, you can see it for yourself how he is with his crewmates, how he is with people, you know, how he is with others who need him. He always tries his absolute best to help everyone that he can and to stop any and all things of tyranny, of evil, of some extent, and stop those who really just want to cause harm. So anyway, uh, hopefully you let me know in the comments below what you think Luffy's dream is or how you feel or what you feel is his dreams in the comments below, your theories and thoughts. Let me know in the comments below, as I just said. And as always, make sure to like this video, subscribe to the channel if you guys enjoy this content. And as always, stay awesome, keep playing and watching One Piece. I'll see you guys next time.